everyone. Welcome to Connect Kids. We're so glad that you're here with us today. Let's get ready to sing, dance, and celebrate Jesus. I put on the full armor of God. Stand strong against the evil one. I put on the full armor of God. The full armor of God. First things first, got the belt of truth. Put on my boots, gotta tell the good news The armor of God and the shield of faith Got my sword and my helmet, now it's time to pray I put on the full armor of God Stand strong against the evil one I put on the full armor of God The full armor of God First things first, you got the bell to truth. Put on my boots, I gotta tell the good news. The armor of God and the shield of faith. Got my sword and my helmet, now it's time to pray. Put on the full armor of God, stand strong against the evil one. Put on. can stand, stand, stand against every evil plan, plan, plan. Now it's time to be strong, strong, strong. He has won. I put on the full armor of God. Stand strong against the evil one. I put on the full armor of God, the full armor of God. I put on the full armor of God. Stand strong against the evil one. I put on Great job worshiping. Let's take a seat and focus on our video. Let's get started. How many places in your home are you able to access water from? You could probably go into the kitchen or bathroom and turn on the faucet. You may have multiple bathrooms in your home that have running water. Perhaps you have a washing machine hooked up to a water line, or you have a faucet outside where you can connect a hose. Did you know that in many places around the world, people do not have access to any clean running water in their home? In fact, many people must walk long distances carrying buckets to get any kind of water. Unfortunately, this water is not clean water. It's very dirty and even carries contaminants that can cause disease and make people sick. After they collect the water, the people must carry it back to their homes, regardless of how heavy it is or how dirty it is. Would you like to drink water like that? Which of these would you prefer? The clean water or the dirty water? Nobody wants to drink this. Ah, imagine not being able to do that. When we give to BGMC, we are able to help ministries like Africa Oasis Project. They help build water wells in areas where people have no water. These wells are located much closer to their homes so they don't have to walk so far. They are usually near churches. That way, when people come to get fresh, clean, physical water, they're also able to hear about the living water that Jesus gives and they can learn how much Jesus loves them. Take some time this week to go on a scavenger hunt throughout your house, counting all the places you can get water to drink. Take that number and spend that many minutes praying for kids who don't have clean water. Pray for the missionaries who are helping bring clean water to them, and not just physical water, but the living water of knowing Jesus. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, thank you for giving me clean water and the living water of knowing that you love me. Help the missionaries around the world to get people clean water and let people know that you love them too. Amen. Whoa, what a cool 
cool video. We hope that you learned something fun and interesting and you can take it home to share with your friends and family. We hope to see you next time here at Connect Kids. Have a great week. Mm -hmm.